Do I do this to myself every fucking time? I want to show you what 20 euro train ticket can get you. So it's 20 euros to Berlin and then 20 euros back, so 40 euros in total. And here we go. I have an entire. Wait, what do you call this place? Compartment. Yes, compartment. That's the word. I have an entire compartment to myself. It's a really funny moment. Two policemen came in and they were like, you know, the first thing they see is me. So they opened the door and they were like, passport, please. I got my passport out. I got my residency card out. I gave it to them. They took my residency card and they were like holding it up against the light to check if it's legit or not. I don't know why. I'm like just sitting there. Right, sure. And it took like literally, I think, about a minute to check everything. They gave me my papers back, took the card from the girl, looked it for five seconds. All right, adios. It was so police here, especially like when they see our passport. They barely deal with international passports, so I don't blame them that they look through the visas, they look through the ID because it's foreign for them as well. And they really want to make sure that you're legal, of course. It's their job, but you know, it's kind of funny because when they left, the girl was saying, Oh my god, they take a lot of time for you, don't they? I was like, Yeah, they need to verify shit. Like, I don't know if you travel a lot, you face that, I'm sure, because you know, if you have a Bangladeshi passport, especially. It's about 1 p.m. I'm gonna go walk around. I'm gonna go see the Eastside Gallery, maybe see a museum, maybe go see Bundestag, and then I should be back by 3.30, take a shower, maybe eat something for once, drink three cups of coffee, and head out to the stadium nice and early. Be nice for a change. Maybe grab some curry first. Oh, be nice. All right, all right, I'm excited. Let's see this. The yeah, is actually not bad, except for this ugly green thing in front of me, the crane. Is that the east side, east wall? I think that's the east wall, there it is. You can actually see it from my room, nice. Okay. Definitely on the common side. Maybe here, right under the German court. It's 100 euros, that's not bad, that's a bargain. All right, there we go. I've marked my territory. Okay, I just realized that I'm running really low on time and I am also wearing Nuremberg colors. So I need to change, I need to change. Oh, I need to carry as minimum stuff as possible so the check is not that long. Oh Jesus Christ, why do I do this to myself every time? Come on, hold the bitch. Oh Jesus. All right, all right, all right. Shower, change, and get the fuck out. All right, I did not know this, but apparently it's a 15 minute walk from the metro train station and I'm really late. There's a bunch of people in front of me walking like really, really fast. Of course, they want to get to the ground as well. And I was reading on the train and I did not do much research, but apparently you have to walk through a f***ing forest to get to the stadium. So yeah, I'm going to turn the camera off because it's really dark. <laughs>
so that was a fun little trip and I don't think it was that eventful even for me because when I go alone that's all I have in my agenda you know I just take the train I just arrive dump my stuff and then find the stadium and that's it really and maybe browse around the city a bit and by the time I arrived um, it was already nine minutes in and I took my place and I thought okay it's a corner should I watch the corner or should I go grab a drink? And then all of a sudden, I just turned to grab my drink. And that's when the goal went in. Everton's header from Nuremberg. And Nuremberg went one nil up. And that's that was a scoreline for their game. I mean, it doesn't sound that interesting, but there were two red cards on Berlin side. And there was one red card from Nuremberg side. So, yeah, there was quite a few fights. Well, not that much fight, but there was some fights in the end. But my takeaway from this game was um, what I like about watching games from the stadium as opposed to watching it at home on TV is that I can f- pick out a player and I can focus on him the entire game. Like when I watch, let's say when I go watch Muller's always like, you know, what their body language is like, how they're acting. And it's the same with Berlin. And the player I picked up was Tony Leisner. And he made me appreciate Per Mertesacker even more because I've never seen a slow ass defender like that. But yeah, next time I come back to Berlin, it definitely has to be Hertha. I want to try Hertha Berlin. And um, well, Oh, okay. <laughs>